Here's Jana making dinner for our D and D group. We're getting ready. So I just wanted to show this. This is a cool trick I picked up a little while ago. We don't really uh, slice our watermelon like in the normal triangles. Um, what we do is we just cut the whole thing in half, like so, and place it on the cutting board with the dome side up. And then I start slicing this way, like that, into long pieces, and then slice the opposite direction. And then what you get is a fun watermelon stick. So anyway, these are great for kids and you get like good two to three bites out of it, so. Mmm. Anyway, this is just a fun thing we've been doing with our watermelon and I thought it'd be fun to share it. See you later. See you at the table. Jana and Andrew. I play Anna Norris. And I play Jandar. Kath. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We're gonna just recap what happened uh, in a previous session. Go ahead. You start. You start. You start. You start. I'm Ian and I play Desmond. I'm Carrie and I play Balthazar. And last time we... on the tower and the shield. We um we left the Dwarven ruins, headed towards the sacred the step. The sacred step. Sacred step. Doesn't so, sound right. Desolate step. Maybe that's what it's called. Desolate step. Two sessions ago, we we were we had just exited the the uh, Dwarven ruins for the first time. That's right. Your brother was there, and he he saved, he, uh, he he, saved us. I think he saved us, and he said. Go with haste. Yeah, and he, then he Hurry. flew away on a griffin. Yeah, yeah. go go close the rift. See yeah. what you can do. Yeah, so, so yeah, he threw away on a griffin. He did. Yeah, that. I'm yeah. glad you write stuff down. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> set out. Um, there was, I think, we traveled for a while. There was a desert. Um, yes, and we made it through the desert yeah. with good, with no problems. Yeah, basically. not really. At least, yeah. 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 Uh, and then we came to a town. Yeah. in the Filled desert. With dwarves. Yeah. Filled with dwarves. But what? we could just go to town, and I'm sure there's a feria in town. There's there. good care for your horse. Okay. Yes. Are we going to stop for provisions? Do you want us to go and... into the town? Yes. Yes. Provisions and procreations. Yeah. As you... Help <laughs> starts to gather oh, no. as you make a speech. People of this good town... Ex excuse me, actually. Where are we? You are... What is it called? Hopeless Prospector's town? Paradise Camp. Yeah, Prospector's Paradise Camp. <laughs> ah, of course we are. I've heard great legend of this place. <laughs> There's mostly dwarves. There's some people too, but they, and they look, they kind of are indifferent to you guys. Except for you, when people notice you, they like physically recoil. They, and they look very unhappy that you're around. Who are pretty racist, uh, racist very dwarves. mean dwarves. They were fine with us. They didn't yeah. like... Yeah. I'm attempting to smile, but it kind of just looks like I grimps because my scales don't really. So I'm like. So Barry, <laughs> your teeth on everyone. Yeah. I think I'm smiling. <laughs> I noticed you all have been staring at my friend here. I like put my head down. He's quite like, harmless. Or he looks quite like one of the salamanders that hunt us in the night. Huh? He may be, yes. Yes. but. And I like smack you. He has traveled with us a great distance. We've come to your land to help rid the world of a great evil. We will need all of your assistance. And at that point, most of them turn away and start going to their their like jobs or whatever they were doing before. There's audible grumbles about. Coin left My over. Uh, horse was slightly injured, so I went to the what do you call it? Farrier. 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 Um, uh, he was not very welcoming of me. Did not like you. He kept calling me a salamander man. Don't know what that means, but I think it's derogatory. Pretty 
Not very nice. Not very nice dwarves. No. They wouldn't do business with her, so I had to do all her shopping. And we basically got rations. Yeah. Just supplies. The, yeah, we sold some uh, weapons. Yeah. Desmond got a horse, I think. Yeah. Desmond got yellow belly. Yeah. Uh, do you have any horses for sale? We have, uh, well, we do have old yellow belly over here. He's a uh, good horse. <laughs> yeah. owner met an untimely demise. Do you have anything more exotic than a horse? Mmm, more exotic than a horse. We have some uh, tortoises. But, uh, <laughs> riding tortoises? Well, I suppose you could ride them. The kids do. They don't go very fast. <laughs> do you deliver tortoises? Ah, uh, I don't deliver. Cause they're here. Desmond has money uh, burning in his pocket. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> this stuff only takes me so far. <laughs> we'll come back to this one. Uh, just the tortoises and the horse then. Uh, oh yes. Plural? Uh, well, horses are hard to come by around here, so uh, I'm gonna have to charge you 750 silver for that thing, and I'll throw in the tortoise for uh, another 100 silver pieces. Sir! That's an expensive horse! Old, old yellow bellies, he's, he's a good boy, he's good for He's got uh, many uh, months left in him. <laughs> Can I go months? look him in the mouth? Go ahead. Go ahead. Don't look at. Can I make a get roll? Get the horse in the mouth. <laughs> yeah. Animal mega... handling. Yeah. You tell. How much insight. for <laughs> insight? insight. See if you oh, good. I think I'm good at insight. I don't know. Oh, I am. Plus five. Ooh. Eighteen. Eighteen. All right. So the horse, you know, is not young, but it does <laughs> look strong, and you. They breed strong horses here to work, like carry heavy loads. Okay. So the horse isn't going to win any injury. races, but it looks sturdy and strong. Mm. What do you what do you think of this horse? It's a pretty penny to pay for a horse. It is, but... Also, how much do you think I could get that Dorfin fella to deliver that tortoise to my tower? Mandrid? Mandrid Heavyfoot. Mandrid Heavyfoot? I, my services only cost a uh, hundred silver a day. Uh, you guys, uh, a hundred silver a silver? day? That's a that's a fair price. It's a fair price. I'm very skilled. What is it that you need again? Uh, I, he doesn't seem very helpful. Yeah, I don't maybe. think he would, unless you like charmed him or something. I don't know if he can Ooh. do that. <laughs> I like the way you think, my man. I didn't say you should charm him. I just said. Oh, I think you did. What, what was your that? price? 750 silver. 750 silver. Well, I'll tell you what, I'm in a bit of a pinch right now. Um, I don't know if you know this, but Wormelsdorf is under attack. Oh, we have heard. We'll sell it to you for 600 silver pieces. 600 silver pieces? I bought myself a horse, finally. His name is Chandler. Chandler. Uh... Chandler. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> yeah. Started as Yellow Belly. His name is Chandler, and Yellow he's belly. beautiful. And I ask our paladin, uh, Jandar, to please teach me how to ride a horse, which he did very well. So well, in fact. I think that I was, I, I was going to give him some horse riding lessons. Yes. Uh, okay. Yes. Um, I want to see him get bucked off his horse. Okay. Uh, we'll do insight. And then... Not 20. All right. Well then, well, I, uh, you roll for insight. Am I on your way? Yeah. Insight. Uh, unnatural 20. Okay. Well then, uh, Desmond, by the end of the horse riding lesson, Desmond can ride a horse better than you can. That's <laughs> Desmond. Well, that. And what else did you buy there? I bought a saddlebag for my horse. And I bought an immovable rod from a nice old prospector. Yeah. And is that like a thing Daniel made up, or is that a real D, &D I, magical thing? I, I, I don't. think I don't know for sure, so don't quote me on this. But I believe it's a, I believe it's a real item. I believe it is. Don't quote me on that. Okay. But anyway, he got it for a steal. Yeah. Uh, one at a time. One at a time. Okay. One at a time. Okay. Okay. I'll, I'll go first. I'll go first, my friend. Oh, okay. That's strange. Ah! Oh no. <laughs> You try as hard as you might. You Go even upstairs. pull yourself up on it, and it Go doesn't matter. <laughs> uh, 17. Total? A total, yeah. 
Twelve plus five is six. Okay. Oh, that's just an athletics. Even you yeah. cannot move the. Was it an athletics check or no. just not? I think you need like a friggin' thirty. Uh, okay. <laughs> I pull out my sword <laughs> and I. You're only like, gonna I, ruin I, I, your I, sword, I, I, there, youngsters. This is a very powerful. You, you okay. can try okay. to hit it, but you're only gonna hurt yourself. How much did you say this object was? Uh, I'll sell it to you for a pound in gold. That's 50 pieces of sand. 50 coins. Sold, my friend! I got um, bullied by some obnoxious obnoxious uh, dwarves. The cow walk off a little bit. Curling insults at you as they walk off. But your pack feels a little lighter all of a sudden. Hey, did you take my stuff? They just they ignore you, they keep going. And I like go after them. You gonna go after them? Yeah, the guy that I knew was touching my stuff. Was he? Sh- he I was like, outside the town. Smack his shoulder. Hey, where's my stuff you took? All right, you're sort of. <laughs> you know, the neighbors are gonna think. <laughs> the neighbors gonna start going out of their house. No, no, it's fine. All right, make an intimidation check. God, I hope intimidation is better. Thunder crook. Oh crap, it's not. <laughs> ah, a little better. Twelve. Alright, they um... Why couldn't it be under wisdom? Why couldn't I be yeah. smart? Perception, survival, I don't know. He's got, you realize that he's got like, in his hand, um... He grabbed... He went to grab something out of your bag, he managed just to grab like, a bag full of what you know are rations. Yeah. Some leftover cheese. Yeah. So, oh, yeah. Some leftover cheese or something. He was probably trying to find something else. But mm-hmm. he says, yeah, you want it? Come get it. And I realize it's cheese. I'm like, way to greet new people in town. Wow. Well, I know, I'm so sorry. You're well, not, I mean, you're I only not, rolled 12, so. <laughs> you're hardly a person. Um, Excuse me? And I walk off. Oh. You're not around. <laughs> I know you're not around. I'm being them. I'm, <laughs> you know there's I a guy that walk around. And, and I check my pack just to make sure everything's fine in okay. there. And I like snap it tighter to make sure. I, I don't think that, like, a dwarf tried to swindle me, him. I think. But yeah, you paid a hundred. What was it? Silver? No. Gold. I paid him a little bit. Where might I find the best place to drink around here? There's only one saloon here. If you want, and you won't even have to walk into that smelly bunch of crowd that's in there. You got it, friend! Oh, thank you. Uh, I'm gonna... That's that's so so and he goes off in a hurry, and he comes back, and he's got Peter. A, some uh, ale in one hand, handing it to you, and in the other he's drinking a pint of ale himself. <laughs> Have you ever right, thought oh. about becoming a servant? Uh, yes, a uh, hundred silver a day. I, I believe I just mentioned that to you, sir. Um, go get us two rooms, Mandred. Yes, but to get to the room, like, I don't think Papa and I, I elbow Janda. Yes. Who is, who is this man, Mandred? He's, uh, he's kind of, I think he's kind of scab on this one. How much for two rooms, man? <laughs> Alright, so if you look at, there's a, quite a few dwarves in there, you know? Alright. Uh, they're kind of rough. And two I, rooms? Wait, so food? food? I could get all that get for, for like, uh, uh, 50 less silver. Our attention no problem, that. sir. 50 silver, my friend! Yeah, it's a good price, isn't it? How good are these rooms? Would you uh, call them lordly? I, I would not, sir. I do apologize. They're not lordly. Excuse I, me. But for Excuse you. Me? Oh, yes. I just yes, bought a madame. tent. Can I just go and sleep in I the tent? I will inspect the rooms and we will decide whether they are up to snuff. Very well. I'll I'll get a key. Yes, and he walks in and he comes back shortly later with the key. He walks up to the rooms and you open it up and they are real rough. They're just, you know. Like bed bug rough? Like or worse <laughs> than the dwarves are rough? In no, the bar? They're about, they match the dwarves. <laughs> Speaking of dwarves, um, two of the rooms have dwarf inside beds, and the other one has human sized beds. <laughs> uh, the, the dwarf has apologized. I'm so sorry. I could not get you beds long enough. I, I, you can have both the rooms for only, I got a deal, and it, it's only going to cost you 20 silver for the rooms and for free. Can I I'm go not. for perception for trustworthiness? 
of his character? Sure, you want to like roll for it. Whether I have like an elfy or... feeling that he's not trustworthy. Yeah, roll for it. For... Yeah, but that's not deceiving him. Oh. That would be if oh, he's yeah. deceiving him. So 17 plus 5? Okay. So you. Um. Do you have an accordion upstairs? It's a toy. Ow. He, um, you get the impression this guy is a little bit of a Scam flake, artist. but, um, but also, you, you don't get the impression that he's, like, He both going blood. to well, us blind in our sleep. Yeah, yeah. Seems like he's probably too lazy to do anything, like, that dangerous. <laughs> uh, not, maybe not lazy, but, um. He's just trying to make a little money. Yeah, exactly. All right, let's get some sleep. I'm tired of fussing around. Well, we need to contribute to the room, the boardroom board. board. So the, the dwarf like kind of helps you guys into the room a little bit, and then he kind of like stands there at the door, kind of his hands folded, his hands back, like, "Thank you, thank you." Is that, is that it? Yes. yes. Thank you. Okay. He's waiting for a tip. Is that? Uh, can I do any, anything else for you? Uh, no, thank you. I give uh, him two pieces of I'll, paper. I'll meet you here first thing oh. in the morning, my good man. Two two cents. And he kind of grumbles out of the room. <laughs> What's he expect? All right. Um, uh, and he brought us breakfast a... and yeah. got us rooms. We got a butler for a day. That's yeah. kind of cool. We, we took we the straight off. path for the most part again. Yep. Um, we were headed towards the rift. We um, had to go through the last hope, around the last hope canyon. Yes, and we slept for the night. That doesn't sound good. And Jandar uh, took watch while we yeah. were sleeping in our two-man tents. And he awoke us to the sound of a clattering battle happening outside the tent. It's all sort of shaking and moving. Yeah. And then out from underneath the sand hops this giant scorpion. A scorpion? Comes out for the night to go hunting. The yeah. scorpion does. And who should happen to be nearby but a bunch of plump horses, <gasps> using that word liberally, a bunch of horses and uh, creatures this giant scorpion hasn't had a meal this well in a while. So, of course, yeah, he charges at the horses. Okay. As it turns out, it was just one giant scorpion that Jandar single-handedly killed before we all walked out of our town. Yeah, you can run and okay. intercept him. Can I, um, sure. and then... To yell, would that take an action? No. No, okay. I yell really loud, WAKE UP! Uh, uh, are you okay there, friend? Um, <laughs> what is going on? I, uh, a scorpion attacked and it got me, but I, I think I'm okay. Hello. Would you like me to uh, heal you with a healing uh, wood? Um, I think, uh, Apparently I'm British now. I think I might just take a nice long, if I bandage it up a little and take a nice long. I'm sorry I woke you, I just, I didn't know. Yeah, and a uh, Jandar, uh, Kill the scorpion in one hit and yes. then woke everybody up because. Yes. <laughs> what? And at that moment, the sand rustles in other areas. Ah, no. And two more scorpions come up through the sands. Oh. I'm glad you woke us. <laughs> yeah, I'm woke us. <laughs> oh my gosh. All right, and we'll just keep the. Do they come up from behind sand? us or like in front of us? Sort like, of like sorry. around you guys. Here. <laughs> uh, three D10 lightning. Lightning damage. I can move this out. Uh, 12, 16. Alright. That scorpion, uh, a little smoke, lightning goes, tsh, 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 and a little smoke comes up from his back. And we killed them. I used yeah, call lightning nothing. and fried it, and we had delicious, nothing delicious. Nothing else extraordinary happened during that fight that Desmond would be super embarrassed about happening. Something happened, but I just don't remember what it was. Tell me now. Nope. All right, Desmond. Desmond is going to turn to the scorpion that attacked him and be like, Ow! Scorching ray! We're all just gonna fry. Yeah. Ooh, can we eat them when they're, we're done? We can certainly try. Oh, I'm gonna eat it. Not the tip, obviously. But... Oh. oh, God. So that's a nat one, so one of them misses. Uh, that's a 16. <laughs> Um, plus eight, which I'm assuming is gonna hit, and this is a ten, which probably doesn't hit. All right, the nat one. Oh, did you just scorch yourself? Probably. Uh, he's counting on his fingers. All right, so you um, 
Roll, roll for damage to the one that hits him. Ooh, uh, nine. fancy dice. Okay, and then roll for the one that you hit your horse with. Oh no! Not yellow belly! No. Seven. Seven. Alright, so you, the horse is, cries out in pain. And so it runs out over the hill. I'm sorry! And we just hear a neigh in the distance. <sighs> Poor yellow belly. You do not have go a ahead, lot of Aaron horses. Norris. All right, I um, I'm gonna go for the one. I don't know. Are there? There's, there's one two fighting of them? belt and one fighting devil. Yeah, yeah basically. All right, the one fighting belt. I will um, attack with my spear. Okay. All right. Oh gosh. Pick better timing. All right. It was a one. <laughs> Oh no. Alright, odds or evens? Odds. Okay. 20. So. Not 20. <laughs> you go to strike with your spear and the, the scorpion. scorpion pinches it in his pincher and no. squeezes and it causes the spear to splinter in half. Oh. And now you're, <laughs> you're stuck with a broken shaft. <laughs> and by the time I was awake, all the killing was gone. All yeah. the killing was done. There was three yeah. scorpions, and I didn't get a single hit. Yeah, yeah. Which is, yeah. that's fine. Make two strikes. Okay. Hey, can I have a half? A 20 yeah. and a I do love four, you. seven plus five is 12. All right. <laughs> the yeah, half orcs do and nice. half orcs do. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so this is the seven hit. Oh, so the 12 does not hit. 12 does not hit. So because that's like a fighter thing yeah. or whatever, or something, you get yeah. an extra uh, yeah. trade or something? It, uh, basically, I can, since when I roll a critical, I can roll an extra dice. Yeah, so yeah, yeah. so you double all three of those. Yeah, okay. Yeah. I, it's, a, it's a damage dice, I feel like. I can reroll the one. Okay, so uh, he's like 12 plus 4 tricks. is 18, so it's 36 damage. Ooh, oh my right. gosh! Um, your sword is just hungry for scorpion flesh, and you manage... <laughs> Scorpion Slayer. You just cut off its yes, claws and I like stab it. it through the center of its face all in one action. Oh my all goodness. Right. We ate the scorpion the next morning. Yeah. Scrambled eggs and scorpion. Yeah. I think, I think Belt was the one who was Belt Scram the one who scrambled them. Yeah. yeah. They were good. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, they, yeah, they were. Uh, so I guess yeah, we kept traveling and then we got to the rift. Down below where you can't see the bottom because there's Smoke and uh, ash, ashy fog. Where can't we We'd see? We'd be up here. Yeah. The sides, like, yeah, I know, like a I know, tunnel. yeah. No, I was And then this is a little um, pathway that's impossibly steep and very narrow, leading out into this area that you can just feel this heaviness coming from. And way off, there's a couple rocks. Way off, you can see a crude altar at the tip of the. Is there anything up this way where we could tie off our horses, or maybe even a little further out to keep them out? Of, I'd rather walk in. Sure, you find a boulder or something to. It was very spooky. Well, yeah, and it foggy. Was a, very, and it was very dark. All of a sudden, there was a lot of moisture yeah. and humidity in the desert. <laughs> yeah, I think we had moved into a kind of a mountain range at that point. We, we rode made it to, to the, the rift, rift, which, as it turns creepy. out, super creepy. Creepy. Um, you don't see any living creature or anything like that, but you do get the feeling like that this place is not abandoned. Can I um, cast okay. Pass Without a Trace? Okay, sure. There's a very narrow Kind of walkway. Pull for um, acrobatics. Acrobatics. Uh, 18. Okay, so you no make it across. Problem. Go ahead. Belt. Belt Azar. Um, 15. 16. So we don't have a negative. Nope. Okay. It's plus one. You know what to do. Dexterity is my lowest score. <laughs> 15. Uh, what is that? Acrobatics? Yeah. Mm -hmm. 18. Okay, you make it across fine. Oh, gosh. Oh, no. Come on, elf. 20. Oh, not 20. And you Plus just, it's like she a She skips around like nothing. Of course the elf. <laughs> She's just like, no sweat. No. Your feet barely <laughs> touch the ground as you. Thanks. You walked on snow. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> um, she took paths without a trace, literally. Yeah. Um, so you, you guys are all Don't safely across. 
And Ooh, I mean, found you all could... the sugar finally. You oh. got the bottom. You find you. It, oh yeah, it is heavier. I was in the middle when she fell. The fog is heavier. Yeah. Say. Now, Jana, you do perceive like a, a spirit or a presence on the far end of this oh. like, peninsula. I'll like say yes. that you do that since you rolled a twenty on Can I? Uh, okay. Can I use my divine sense? Sure. Yeah. To uh, see if I sense any uh, celestial so... fiend or undead within uh, sixty feet of us. Yes. Um. You use that. Yes. And you feel it all about you. Mm. All right. In every direction. In every direction. Of a fiend. And a, a fiend and undead. Oh, and undead. Ooh. Guys, I sense fiends and undead around us. I sense very oh, I that's not, that's present not the evil. Works. You rolled stealth, you don't have to worry about anything yeah. now. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean. Very yeah. present um, evil. Um... Can but I? there's still nothing tangible in front of us you or anything. No. Oh, never mind. That would take too long. I don't have a prepared. I'll be a good boy and remember that I have spells that are not prepared. All right. I draw my sword because I'm feeling more and more unsafe. Anxious. And I have my shield up and ready. Um, who has the basket on them? She does. I have the basket. And are our stones and our daggers doing yes. anything? They are glowing very well. Okay, that's what I thought they'd be doing. Mm -hmm. All right, can I We're, look at the basket I think we'd have to go to the closely altar. with my magnifying glass? And I just yeah, bought one. I was like, it, is there any way that I can see if it's doing anything? Okay, you look at it under the magnifying glass, and it doesn't look like it's doing anything. But when you look underneath the mag, like in this in this atmosphere, it seems to almost like have a slight glow from within. Mm, from like, within. It's like the material itself. Not, okay. You know. Mm. So like, I like saying, Psst, guys, look. Can you see it glowing? Um, I like push my dagger towards it a little bit to see if it does anything. Nope. Nothing happens. Mm. Okay, nothing's happening. Okay. Let's keep going. We're moving towards the altar. Is that where we should go? I, I turned to Desmond. I like that you and I are whispering I have and a, he's like, I have a bad That was me. <laughs> Never anyone I know. Doing. Doing. I turn to you and I have a bad feeling about this. <laughs> After you, my friend. Okay. I, uh, I... Go, go, tank, go. What should we do? There's <laughs> plenty of space. I'm watching the tank. Um, I, well, I will slowly follow okay. behind. So I, I, I proceed towards the altar. I'm a, okay. Did... So, so you get about there. About here? Okay. okay. Is anyone going with him? I'm, yes, I'm we'll go. I'm slowly. Are we staying in the same order we were in, basically? You can go wherever you, however you want. You kind of stop right. every other way. I kind of want to go over to this right. side. Right. Or, uh, Balthazar, do you want to put yourself somewhere else? No, yeah, okay. I, I'm, I'm fine there. Okay. And we found and... a little altar. Mm hmm. We stopped in the um, middle. But while we were there, we got attacked mm -hmm. by. What was uh, that thing called? For our intimates As you guys approach, suddenly a big woof of oh. wind comes up and black smoke kind of rises up all around the edge of this little rock island. And out of the dark mists, a. I will butcher the way you say this, but um, a cambion appears. It's basically yes. a winged. Person that's red skinned. Oh, okay. and in a, it's a demon. Though. Look at it's look at the people that know from, the uh, oh, no. monster man and <laughs> oh, expression. No. If my memory serves me, which is I believe it's like it's like a dem it's like a de half demon. demon or something like that. Yeah, uh, demon. Don't, yeah, again, don't. I I haven't read it the was book in a while, but it was some kind of it was a demon basically. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> look at his. Um, We're both like, what? Well, like, sounds easy, red guy. Yeah, yes. red guy. <laughs> to tread upon this land, this holy land. Ooh. You mean unholy, foul beast? <laughs> and then, from around you, wraiths sort of materialize out oh, of the mist. Oh golly! And they they sort of form a ring. Oh, too many. Who are you? Oh, Let's talk to him. I... We are, we are the tower and the shield. We are on a I, I kinda of like Jenna kinda of looks at it like, oh, what the heck? We seek We to are on a quest to uh, place this basket on that altar. This weak magic you bring can tear apart the strong bonds in this world. In this place. Who is this elf? I'm just an elf. <laughs> 
and this weakling I... of a man. Fair point, but... <laughs> What's your name? I am Desmond of House Leodric. And with that, there's a hiss from all the wraiths. <laughs> and they say, House of Leodric, can it be? And then they see the book that you're carrying. Yes. I'm assuming you have it on your person. Yeah, 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 yeah. I do. And they say, there's a rumor about them. They say, can this be an heir of Quinity Leordric? Uh, I, I like glance at Desmond. Like, ah. <laughs> I'm here, aren't I? <laughs> <laughs> they say, wait, he's, uh, he was, he was one of the two that betrayed us in this moment and gave warning oh. of our ritual. Oh, maybe he can leave, my goodness. Maybe he can lift the curse that ties our spirits. And, and most of the race sort of dissipate back into the fog. But two, the closest two, still stay out and fight and say, it cannot be. Gwyneth T died in the desert. Explain it later. I can assure you, I am in fact his heir. Then we will bring death to you, so that we might live forever. You will bring death to yourselves. (laughs) All right, roll for initiative. (laughs) All right, ten. (laughs) You know when you're ready. It, it looks a little worried because it was not expecting an heir, uh, someone from the house of the Ordric to come by. I mean, who really would expect that? Who would expect that? <gasps> oh, that's, that's like so painful. Crazy. Um, so he looks at Desmond and says a few words to you that you don't quite understand, but you feel drawn to it by some sort of power, Ooh. some sort of magical. You, when you lock eyes with them, it sort of pulls you, and you gotta make a charis- you have to make a charisma saving throw. Okay. And he says, "I can make you more powerful." Ooh. Mm-hmm. Oh gosh. You're going to be. Oh, oh so close, close to, to a twenty. 20. A charisma. Yes. yes. Oh man. Um. Oh. Uh, hold on. No. You're being summoned. Uh, sorry. Wisdom saving throw. Okay, that's that's better because that's a plus eight instead. <laughs> so that's a sixteen. Okay. Uh, oh, he's not being turned to the dark side now. Good. good. Um, yeah, we'll go with that. We'll go with the sixteen. And hope so that's you, he tells you, he tries. You can hear him, hear him talking in your head, trying to convince him, convince you to do your, his bidding. Okay. But fortunately, you do not bow to his power. Thank and, goodness. Uh, resist. resist. <laughs> I yell resist at you because I can see your struggle. That was a fun fight. One of us single-handedly saved the day by using Maximilian's earthen grasp and keeping the... Uh, Kept him from fa- flying yes. away while uh, Jandar hacked at it like a piece of meat. Yes. Desmond like put a... a Made a giant hand pop out of the ground. Yeah, and, and was holding him. Yeah. So he wasn't like attacking him. And, and then I ran, I ran up and started hitting him with my swords. Yeah. And 14. Does 14 break the... Mm, no. I think he said it was 15. 16. <laughs> 13. To 20, 28 damage on top of that. All right. Uh, sorry. With the power of Helm, you so managed to you? conquer. It was like... 50, sir. Oh 40, God. 50 something. I don't know. I killed a wreath yeah. with my sword. Even hit, I don't think I got hit, but that was probably because yeah. he was being restrained by the yeah. Desmond's hand. I, honestly, if Desmond hadn't had that hand pop out, I think we probably would have all died. So uh, there is silence once again on the step. And we don't sense any more evil? Mm-hmm. Still... Well, uh, it's more yeah. incapacitated or cowed. Okay. Yes. Um, so there's nothing between you and the yeah. altar. Alright, guys, right. right. yeah, go. You still feel evil around you. Yeah. yeah. There's still all those yeah, wraiths evil. that yeah. chose not to fight. Yeah. Okay. Um, what about the swords on yeah. the. Alright, there are two wraith swords. We got some. I got a wraith longsword out of it, which is pretty cool. I should warn you that when you sense for good and evil, 
the swords themselves seem to be evil. Mm. We got mm. two of these? Two of those. Be yes. careful yeah. with that. Does <laughs> anybody want? I'm gonna I'll take, take this one, one and sell it. I, you can't I sense, sell an evil sword to I someone. I sense evil from that. You probably might not want to take that with you. Why can't you sell an evil um, sword? What, what kind of sword do you have? Because this actually might be better than yours. I have a great sword, so I do 2d6 damage. Yeah, but well, this one's a 1d10 plus an extra 1d8 necrotic damage. But, yeah. really but I sense evil coming from the sword, so I, I'm just. I, 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 I know it's better, but. Uh, Why not? Okay. Uh, I, I sense I'm evil. taking one of okay. them at least. I we got our yeah. All right. I, All right. I lay my eyes upon the altar. Can I see it clearly mm -hmm. from my direction? All right. I'm can going I for... kind of sense whether there's. Can I perceive, look around with my uh, best ability to perceive any danger to their surroundings around it? Just or... the very far drop at the edge of the. And then. We we put the we, uh, we you took put the basket out and the you put the daggers, the daggers on, the daggers on the altar. We should probably backtrack a bit. There was an altar. There was an yeah, altar at and, the end, edge, and that's what yeah. we were drawn to. Like we yeah. wanted to go there because that was where all the power was coming yeah. from. So we put these articles on there, yeah. and it did something. Yeah. So as you guys place the daggers. And everything on the altar, okay. there's a humming noise that gets louder Ooh. and louder, and the whole thing starts to vibrate. Oh no, it's gonna fall to the. Yeah. And it gets louder and louder, it's ringing in your ears, and all of a sudden there's quiet, and then the whole altar, there's this big force that goes boom, away from the altar, and the altar collapses into water <gasps> down the side Your of the sister. thing. And you guys, everyone has to make um, a strength saving throw. Oh, strength. Oh, no. Strength. I'm going to be honest, guys. This isn't my strength. Yay, no. 22. Yeah. I'm good. I heard a four. He's <laughs> got a 16, actually. Not, oh, not bad. Okay, I got a 14. All right, so everyone who did not roll 15 oh, no. gets no. pushed back 10 feet. Okay. Mm. Just like yeah. this far? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, How'd you get so far back, or did you just run away? No. Okay. no we, he was like right feet. there. So. Yeah. Alright, and everyone takes 10 force damage. Me too? Yes. Oh gosh. You're lucky, Belt. You're the only one that was going to fall off the cliff if you got pushed backwards. Why? <laughs> you're, like, you're the you're, only you're one right that right saved right on the, the cliff. You're right on the edge of the cliff. <laughs> But well, you're okay. I didn't put me on the cliff. That was the end of Belthazar. I didn't. Yeah, uh, it, it basically closed the rift into the end of it. It closed the rift yeah. and created an earthquake. Yeah, the whole like, the altar collapsed into a into the chasm. The whole place place was shaking. We yeah. all had the run. It blew us back, and, and the entire place started crumbling. Yes. So lots of shaking. The earth starting to shake, and parts of this is starting to fall off. Oh, around run! You guys. What have you done? Run. What run. have we done? We're becoming I'm You guys running. notice that no, you I'm running? running. Oh, as oh. you come over here, you notice that this is starting to fall apart. Oh, I'm God. Just, I'm running. Uh, all I'm right, running. Make, a, make an acrobatic check. I tried to run first. Forgot I could turn into a spider and almost fell off. Uh, it's over here. Oh, God. I fell off. Oh, gosh. That was... I died. No, no. Oh, that was Dex. I have a whopping five. I was acrobatics here. Oh, acrobatics? Yeah, I have a five. Okay, you slip and fall off. Mm hmm. Quick roll for sleight of hand. Me? Sleight of hand? No, I want the yourself. other one back. A good one. Listen. Twelve, sleight of hand is. Which one's that one? Uh, sleight of hand, so 13. Alright, so you managed to just barely grab on Help! to a small part of the Help! rock below. And, um, but you're Wait, 10 feet below. You're 10 feet below the edge. Now, who else is coming up? Quick, behind oh, I, you. Oh, I run. Yeah. Help. Yeah. Sorry, I'm I... I'm throwing. Alright, forget it. Oh, All right. yeah, I am. I can turn into a spider. <laughs> you, you started falling off, and then... Well, I grabbed hold as Somebody was... reminded you that you could turn into a spider yes, quite later. Yes, some amazing uh, DM. <laughs> <laughs>
Um, yeah, yeah. save us. I'm so glad you all are dex or acrobatics. Acrobatics, natural 20. All right. Yay. So you managed to run across just fine. Who's, who, what are you guys doing? I'm running, running. I'm running. I'm, running. I'm going to turn into a right. spider and keep roll, going. Roll for <laughs> dex and acrobatic saving throw. I'm a spider right, and I'm running away. Plus, uh, all right, so it's don't forget your Okay, you managed to make it across. I'm I'm a, Desmond, I, what I are grab, you doing? I grab my, I'm, I'm, oh my god. <laughs> Jendar made it. Um, Anoris made it. I, I fell. <laughs> I pulled out my immovable rod as I'm running. Okay. And ah! you're gonna need it. Six, uh, that's a nine. Okay, you slip on the crumbling rock and you start falling. I'm gonna shove my immovable rod into it and hold on to it. All right. What happened? If you hold on to it, you guys, now you have to try to pull yourself up. Okay. I'm going to uh, use my spider your car- web. Let's see how much you're carrying. Uh, I'm going to make use my spider oh. web and start creating a uh, web need, like, to like, get him. To get him. <gasps> it's yes. not that much. It looks okay. like a lot. You have to roll a strength saving throw. Right. I'm, I'm swinging to uh, make Help a him. web to, that oh, he can catch it. Oh, six. Oh. Okay. Yes. Well, I'm you you go to the drop, but the web saves you just in the nick of time. I'm webbing you. Nice. Are you, now you're hold, are you holding the web? I I'm like attaching it from the cliff. Right, like quick, I'm like make a strength saving throw. So I, I grab I grab Belteser's like four legs that I can. Okay, hold you can roll with heart. advantage because she's helping you. Okay, good. She's helping me. I need another one. Oh wow, that's not much. Oh, uh, it was strength ten. All right, so you managed to keep him from falling, but you guys are on the very edge of the cliff. We gotta hear you. Jesus, help us! How far down are they? They're on no, the edge. No, I'm They're on the edge, edge, and I'm keep right, trying to I keep run, them I run, I run, and I grab her front legs. Okay, make a that. strength saving throw. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are either all gonna we're gonna pull or we're gonna Uh, twelve plus five is. 17. We're either gonna die with you or all right, survive. You with managed you. to pull up halfway. Yeah. Oh no. You have to make a saving throw. Come on, help us. saving throw to see if you hold on. Okay. I'm gonna. Uh, or do whatever. Or uh, do an action too if you want to. On okay. Top of that. Good. All right. Cool. Anything else? Oh, oh god. god. That's a six. All okay, right. And what? What's your action? I'm, I'm, I'm using my mage hand to grab the immovable rod and bring it towards me. Okay. So you, you are slipping and falling. Yes. Please help me. We're all trying what, to. What are you gonna do, you. quick? Um, I'm He's just falling creating out of your web. more web. I'm making more right. web. Am I'm webbing like crazy. Yes. I'm going to stab a dagger in into the ground as hard as I can and hang onto it with my You don't have your, you have your sword. I have a dagger. No, but That's that was the dagger. the dagger we had in there. Oh, it's- I you have another dagger. dagger. Okay, I, I have, have a sword. No, no, she bought a dagger. Never mind. Oh, she bought I a dagger. That's a dagger. Okay. Dagger. Yeah, I didn't have a dagger. Okay, and what are you going to do? Swing over the edge to try to catch him? No, my phone's on my No, it's just going to hang on to belt. Is that what I need to Okay, do? that's great. Yeah, okay. you're holding um, on to me. She's much lighter now because he's falling through the air. Oh, and no. you're from behind. What What do you do? I'm webbing oh, trying God. to catch him. Um, he's falling through the air. Oh, I'm just going to stick my... Uh, uh, you have, my, you, you have, have it. Thing? Yeah, yeah. sticking it in the side of the rock and I'm holding on. Uh, now, back to that immovable rod. That darn thing saved his life. Because if, like, he, hadn't, if he hadn't bought that, At least. that he would have died. Yeah. But... Okay. I hope. Do you push the button? Jim, yes, I push the button. All right, roll for sleight of hand. See if you can do it in time. Oh god. Oh good. This is this is a good one for me actually. I want one. one. Nope. Three. Oh, no. No. Oh, no. Was it eleven? But no, I have I have, have a plus, plus six. Oh, plus six. I yeah. have plus eight. Oh my god. Yeah, nine. All right. Can Come on, I, man. Can I take a rope and? Like, I had a climber's kit in my bag, I but rope. I don't know what it does. Okay. I have so you ball. fall I, another oh, fifteen feet. All right, so I'm gonna everybody back up. Okay. Right, I like start back calling, and um, I transform back into me, and I grab my bag, and I have a climber's kit. I have a yeah. And I have a grappling have. hook. I have, I have rope. Exploring and I have rope. I came prepared for a situation such as this. And then through some uh, good teamwork. Yeah, I grab onto the rope to okay. pull it. You know, who's and going down? Rope. I'm going down. Okay, okay do it. Down. Roll. Start praying for us. Roll for. Her. Okay. <laughs> Roll for strength. Help doesn't really work like that. 16, 19. All right. Uh, 19. You, man- you managed to get down to the ledge where he's dying. Come on. All right, I'm grabbing on the you. Know, and I had extra rope like okay. that. All right, so, so he's, he's on, so we'll start yes. pulling you up. Pull us up. Everyone make strength saving throws. 
got a two. Eight, two. Oh I have a, a whopping five. Oh my God. Oh my Which I and they again, dropped us. Didn't, didn't do so well. We, no, we they dropped us. Again. We were able to. It took a while. Four we all kept. Rolls. We, we were rolling allowed, terrible, yeah. but we kept trying to like yeah. pull them up. Um, okay, the rope slips from your hands, uh, and they fall another fifty feet. Why am I trying to help you? Down to the you? chasm. Uh, but right before we fall, I want to hit the. I want to hit my movable rod and stop us both. You still okay, have roll it, slit hands. <laughs> My gosh! I can turn into a spider one more time. Oh my time. god! I can turn and save myself. I tried to help you, I'm out. He saved himself from falling too. Okay. But I'm now. Back up the wall. But now the rope is long enough that you can try to pull yourself up. It'll be a little easier now that you're just pulling Desmond up and not two bodies. Yeah, we eventually. Yeah, we eventually were able to get him up. Yeah. Uh, and it was we all. Scary. Yeah, it was. It was really bad. <laughs> Uh, and all my pull me! Pull me up, oh. children! Now I'm done with you. Uh, 18 you points. Rolled Jonah, you rolled that one! <laughs> Jonah, you can like give people inspiration dice and stuff. I, I did! I only had two and uh, I did. Yeah, she was oh, done. I, I, she's I rolled a uh, uh, 23. Oh, 12. Good. 14. <laughs> Alright. Aaron always completely let go of the rope. <laughs> but that's okay because he uh, single handedly manages to pull Desmond up and Desmond crawls up himself. Come on! And you finally get him to the top it's of the exhausting. ledge. Exhausting. <sighs> I see that you guys are up and my little spider legs just climbing out of there. Yes, yeah, so I was going to say, as soon as I get up, I'm running. Yes, yeah. I'm just going to run. horses. Go. Yes. Are our horses on solid ground now? Yeah, they're on solid ground. Uh, yeah, I've run. <laughs> uh, we, we, we were... <laughs> we narrowly escaped. We narrowly escaped. Yeah. All of us. So, yeah, yeah and then um, we decided once we had accomplished this, we were yeah. exhausted and yeah. shaken up, literally. Yeah. <laughs> we all almost died, yeah. so yeah, we were, we so were ready to take a rest. We but... pretty much went back the way yeah. we came. We rested, and then that's where our... our the, session the last two uh, two closed. sessions ago closed oh. stuck for the night pretty much yeah. too and then we just kind of rested and that's where we ended our session and week. well anna norris said she felt the earth and it felt like it was slowly beginning to heal special thing you have that special thing you can talk to the land or something right yeah just like the mechanic well uh -oh. it, it feels better like the land like is like a better. it's not it's not like you know, it is perfect, but the land is becoming whole. It's not suffering. You feel like the ground is not suffering as much as it used to be. Can you send a message somehow to so your I'm brother? So I lay face down on the ground. It's not suffering anymore. And I'm just looking at you like. <laughs> you want to get down there with a holy man? Uh, I'm good, thank you. Okay, so that's that's where we ended the session. Yeah. And uh, thanks for watching this video with us. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Yeah. Do you have anything to close with? Um, uh, keep watching. <laughs> keep watching. <Yeah. laughs> so there you have it. We healed Thank a rift. Woo! One step closer. Uh, you the second one? Yeah, just awesome.